hello guys welcome back to my channel i'm so happy to have everybody here today hope everybody is doing great and fine today i'm going to cook rice and um these are all the recipe i'm going to use to cook my rice or to prepare my rice so here we have um sweet um pepper this is the sweet pepper i use this um this one's the sweet um snack bite pepper that is the naturally is more or less sweet peppers this is how they look like this is how they look like so i just dice them into little pieces and that is it and here we have um crush crush uh, chili i'm going to use all because there's not much in there so here we have chickpeas and here i don't know if i'm going to use the whole thing of chickpeas maybe half of that we do and sweet corn and here we have um um irish peas the green peas double peas yeah and here we have our mixed apps cloves black pepper and here is a basil and here is um um caraway seed i'm using um light soy sauce and i love that cake of vinegar so i'm going to be using basmati vinegar my seasoning the one i'm using is finished i've not mixed it so my seasoning i don't use salt in my cooking because this um um seasoning contains salt so and too much salt is not good and here is um my ginger i preserve this i really want to do the video yesterday but i'm so tired so maybe i'll do it sometimes next time so this is my preserve um garlic oh ginger sorry and this is my preserve garlic that i have so it's working so well see so fresh in there so there is it and then um, here i have um um chicken hearts i just let me show you how it looks like let me bring this this is how it looks like i bought that from polish shop it's so it's much inside just take one and this is how one of it looks like i just cut it into four pieces i want it small so that's that okay my hands and um definitely onions i love onions and i think that's all and yeah my rice i look you can use any rice of your choice i'm using long grain rice and the oil i'm going to use i'm going to use um peanut butter peanut oil there is it you see i'm using peanut oil so so that is it so let me start from my um spice i'm taking my crushed chili just the whole lot of it I'm going to use um black pepper just just tiny so mix apps just tiny the basil just tiny So the curry, 
caraway seed i'm going to be using tiny as well so clove you make sure this uh, clove is bitter so just little little and um, pinch of it will be will be okay if you don't want to spoil your cooking that's it just pinch so that is all my spice out there so let's get to our cooking guys okay guys the pot is on the um on the gas this pot is on the gas i leave it to dry up so i'm going to be adding um my oil that's a uh, peanut oil i just smoke no, what happened to this um, peanut? I left the peanut for a long period of time to just release the hoy in it. So that's it. So that's the small oil I'm going to be using. I'm going to leave it to to um to alt before I start um doing my stuff. So there is the garlic. You can see my label. So cute. Oh, have a very nice and powerful, strong smell. So I'm just going to use uh, my fork and bring one out, a clean, dry um, spoon or anything that you are using. So that's it. I leave the skin off on it so I'm going to be putting it I'm going to drop it into my pot like this just for it to infuse into the into the pan then I'm going to cover this up so that's it you can see that's what I want just squeezing just want the flavor to release into the hoy. It's because of the liquid that is there. That's why it's... Oh! I can open my ginger. Oh my god. It's tight. Yeah. So that's it. I'm going to take just small out of it. Just that bite is okay. Can you see? So I'm going to release that. I'm going to release that into my pot. So guys, um, so that is it. The garlic and the ginger have um, already infused into the into the hoy. I quickly attend to something. That's why I hope it. So I'm going to take the skin out. Going to take the skin out. So I'm going to leave it there till it gets soft. Going to leave it there till it gets soft. So at this stage, I want my. I have to pour in um, my onions just to fry it a little bit. I 
cut it to get burnt just to to fry a little bit and i'm going to add my pepper everything is going to fry together So in here, I'm going to season it all and add uh, my seasoning, just little, because I'm going to use part of it for the chicken art that I have there. I just want some of the seasoning to just penetrate into that. I want them to steam together. So here, let me get a spoon. So there is it. That is the seasoning I'm using. Just have to use more now because I'm still going to use um. The remaining for I'm still going to season uh, my my meat chicken at there so I'm going to leave this for them to to steam together so I'm going to leave that then I'm going to go ahead so I'm coming here again just so I have to open my order okay. they are quite um the pieces already done they are mochi so soft i'm not going to cook this it's so soft let me call this there is uh, the chickpeas i'm using this they're not much in there is the liquid that was much so so I have to let them just do together like that. The season is fine. Let me open my sweet corn. So I'm going to add the sweet corn now. So, so at this stage, I'm going to pour it into another glass um, oil bowl. Because I'm still going to cook them later to steam. So I'm going to pour them into this, my glass bowl. In the same pot. In the same pot, I'm going to add little oil there. I need more oil. Just small. So here I'm going to add um, my chicken. I'm 
not all the flavor in there i want them to infuse into the snake that then straight away i'm going to add my seasoning all the remaining seasoning is going in there and i'm going just to let them cook in there i'm going to add my seasoning maggie just to spice it up so i'm going to leave it there to fry Okay guys, I had the garlic inside to fry together with this. You see, I, I can't really press it. I'm going to remove it and add it to the rice so that they can really get soft and infuse into the rice as well. So, at this stage it's done, I'm going to bring them out. I'm going to leave my garlic behind. I'm trying to check. If, uh, I, have, I am trying to check out from my garlic. Because I want to, I want them to infuse very well into the can only see the other part okay i'll see the second one so this i'm taking this one out so so I have my garlic left in there. So I'm going to be pouring in my rice. So I need to rinse my rice. So, I'm pouring my rice into my pot. So, oh my god. That's it. So I'm going to I'm going to leave my rice to do his own thing. So you can see the garlic is inside there so i'm not going to pour the chickpeas water the liquid i got from the chickpeas there is it i'm going to use it to cook my rice and the liquid i got from the um 
green paste i'm going to use it to cook my rice as well nothing going to waste then i'm waiting for For my rice, I don't really use to season rice whenever I cook rice, but because I'm using it for that is um spice in the pot already that is going around i'm going to leave it because i've already seasoned my um chicken at and um my um peas and uh, pepper onions and uh, sweet corn there so i'm waiting for my hot water to get ready while i'm waiting for that i'm going to leave this to keep on steaming i think I'm going to add um, more ginger to cook through. There's it, just small like that. And that is it. I'm going to cover the rice up and set it aside. See immediately. Just because I'm frying something. This pot is very good. Very, very good. It got it doesn't burn anything. It doesn't burn something. It's very good. going to leave that it's going to keep on steaming and steaming and steaming and steaming so I'm going just going to pour my water you know your rice this my rice if if I don't play with it very well it's going to be mochi and I don't want much rice so I'm just going to add the water little by little little by little I'll cover it. I will leave it to steam off. Then I will come back to it and check it. So I'm going to be adding um here the fried um chicken uh, breast. So I'm going to mix them together. So I'm going to leave them, let them steam together, it's, it's frying now because the water is dry. So I'm going to see the, um, what is it called, the, I want to press the garlic. Yeah. So I'm going to add um, let me taste because I have to taste if they if the season is okay. I see need the, I see have this one here. I have to pour this one into it, then I will taste for the season. If the season is not okay, I have to add uh, more, more season to it. Okay. 
Let me taste it. It needs no season, guys. No more season. It depends on your taste bud anyway. But this season is okay for me. So what I'm going to do here. And to cover it, I'm going to off my gas. The gas is still working. So I'm going to hide it. So this is what we have here. So I'm going to cover it like that. I let it season through. It's so good guys, so so good. So for that I'm going to be hiding my my piece at the top. Going to use the whole lot. So going to have that and see I've had that to it so I'm going to So I'm going to cover it and let it season. Okay, guys, let's see. It's done. It's really steam. It's done, that's it. So simple to prepare. Don't want to mix too much because of the green peas. They are very soft. So that's it, guys. You see? Okay, guys, that's it. The rice is done. The stem is done. You can see. That's it. That's the head of it. That's the hand. Let me taste. So salt. It melts in your mouth. Very nice. So guys, that's the end of it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And press that notification button. So that you'll be the first person to be notified. Whenever I re release a new video. And um, share, like. So that's it. See you later. See you in my next new video. Take care. Bye.